Hello YouTube. Uh gonna start well actually I've already started this kit, but I'll show you what I've got done so far. I took the rat trap, the frame and everything from it, the engine, wheels, and then took this 69 Chevy Corvair and cut up the body and I'm using it uh for this modified instead of the uh the vega body so so far as you can see i cut the wheel area out the back and then cut the front off this uh is of course going to be glued down in the back the uh hood lid because the engines are actually in the back of the corvair so I got that done, and then I cut the hood of the rat trap, and the hood will actually be the uh, the back, um, the trunk lid of the Corvair, and made a hood piece for the car. And then I painted the... Uh, the framework and everything, like a lemon color. So that is what it'll roughly look like. It's not done yet, but that'll be close. An idea of what it's gonna look like. Okay, so I got the uh, framework done, the engine done. I know it looks a little wild with the yellow and the red, but once the body goes on, it all comes together. It looks pretty neat. Um, this kit, <laughs> there's there's definitely some issues with uh, especially the roll bar area with lining up. Um, there's quite a few issues with this kit, but this is an older kit, so you got to give it a break. Springs lining up, not very good. Like I said. It's an older kit, so you kind of expect that. Uh, I'm not gonna dirty it up. It's just gonna look almost brand new. I might throw a little bit of uh, stuff on there one of these days, but this is about as far as this one is going to go. And there it is with the body over top of it all done up. Always put a name on top. That is the name of our dog that just passed on, Cato. So this one is for him. But that is what it looks like. Like I said, it, you think it's going to look different with the uh, yellow and red until you see that blue with it. And then it turned out real well. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I thank you for watching and God bless.